I hope and pray that we listen to each other's voice and pray that the voice of reason and the voice of Christ, the peacemaker, will triumph. The 4th of January, 2022, I was away this week last year at a conference in Austin. I got to my room on the 6th of January, which in most parts of the world is the actual day the Feast of the Epiphany is kept. But I think in my mind from now on and from that date forward, it will be the day of the storming of the Capitol, where legislators and elected officials were in fear of their lives, remembering that those who work for the safety of the capital and those who work there and visit, their lives endangered. Some were killed, as were some of the protesters. In my mind, it's almost a worse day than the 11th of September, because in that case, it was foreign nationals. So let's pray hard that the beauty of our democracy the beauty of true beauty of being an American, where all can find a voice. And if they all have a voice and they speak at the same time, there will be mayhem. But I hope and pray that we listen to each other's voice and pray that the voice of reason and the voice of Christ, the peacemaker, will triumph. Keep safe. God bless. Please like, subscribe or comment below.